All right, my friends, welcome back to this YouTube channel. Today, we're going to be talking about what is BIM and how it can benefit you as the user, how it can benefit your project if you're a developer or if you're a GC. So today, I'm going to take you on an adventure. I'm going to bring you to my workplace and I'm going to show you guys a glimpse of what I do at work as well as talking about BIM. So without further ado, let's get right into it. So what is BIM? To put it simply, BIM is just a set of 3D models that are comprised of six traits. You have your architectural, your structural, mechanical, electrical, plumbing, and fire life safety. Now you might ask, why is BIM so important? BIM is important because it allows you to spot problems early on in a 3D environment. You know, it's a lot more expensive to fix construction during construction than it is during pre-construction. BIM also helps you visualize what you're going to build before you're building it. Because a lot of times owners make last minute decisions in the field when they realize that this structure isn't what they want. This wall is not in the right place. Let's move that wall. This paint color isn't that great. Let's change the paint colors. So if you can have all that before construction, that would greatly reduce changes in the field. And that also allows the construction team to build on time and on budget. My favorite part about BIM is the fact that BIM helps to reduce miscommunication and makes teamwork a lot better and smoother. Do you want some chocolates? Thank you, man. No worries. Okay. Now, if you ask me, what are some of the coolest features of BIM? I'm going to say my top five favorite would be clash detection, cost estimation, construction scheduling, facility management, and sustainability. BIM is not just about visuals. BIM can help you save money, save time, operate your buildings, and help you go green. So now let's dive into the five favorite features of BIM. So the reason why clash detection is at the top of my list is because you're spotting issues now during pre-construction that may save you 10 times later down the road during construction. And my friends, that is huge because during construction, you're already paying for cost of supporting the job, like paying for a project manager, or superintendent. You're paying for construction interest in the loans that you take as the owner. You're paying for opportunity costs because every month that you delay the job, that means 100 people cannot rent, the, rent your building. So the cost of delaying the job is 10 times more expensive than paying somebody to do clash detection for you during pre-construction. A lot of people may not know this, but BIM can help you estimate your material quantities and cost directly from the model. That means if you go from a single pane window to a double pane window, your BIM model is going to automatically update on its own without you having to manually count each window and multiplying by the unit price. This can help you save a lot of time. And once you experience this for yourself, you'll never want to go back to the old and traditional way of cost estimating. So for construction scheduling, BIM allows you to import your project timeline into the model using Navisworks. You can create a time-lapse video of your project set by your construction scheduler, whether it is two years or three years, you can put it into the model. And when you play that video, it would literally show you how your project is going to be built from the ground up to completion. And it's like watching the project unfold before your very eyes. And what you can also do with Navisworks is give a weekly update to the project timeline, keep your subcontractors accountable. And by doing so, you can stay on top of your schedule. All right guys, so once the building is done, BIM is not done. BIM can also act as a tool for facilities management and it can help you track real-time water leakage and equipment failures using BIM as a visual tool with real-time alerts. It just sounds too good to be true, right? All right, lastly, BIM can help you go green. BIM can help you simulate your energy usage, optimize lighting, and reduce material waste through cost estimation. On top of that, BIM can help you visualize the project without you having to print out a bunch of drawings and read them manually to understand what's going on. So you're not just saving trees, 
but you're also reducing carbon footprint by better and more efficient green buildings. All right, my friends. So if you like BIM and you want to get into BIM, but you don't know how to do it, I do know of a course called Architectural Drafting by Course Careers that would be able to help you. It is a six to 12 week long program that costs around 500 bucks to get into, which is not very expensive. There's a low barrier of entry while reaping a lot of benefit after you graduate, making roughly 50,000 to 70,000 a year, depending on where you live in the country. And if you live outside of the United States, trust me, this program is also going to help you because the softwares that you use are pretty much universal. Every country in the world uses these same softwares like SketchUp, Revit, and Navisworks, as well as AutoCAD. Because when you first graduate and you start your career as a drafter, you're going to be mainly using AutoCAD to draft drawings in 2D. You would mainly work with architects, engineers, and sometimes even construction companies. It's a good start because you can grow your way into a BIM engineer by starting out as a 2D drafter and working your way to becoming a 3D engineer. So if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel for more videos like this. And I will see you guys on my next video.